Fresh from the showcase at Swiss Watch Expo, one of the coolest complication watches we've come across in really useful functions. It combines a GMT function with an alarm coming up. I love it at Swiss Watch Expo when we see things come through that I've never seen before. And this is one of those really cool watches. This is a Blancpain, it's a 40 millimeter dressy watch, but talk about a great set of functions for the traveler. This has the GMT, so you always know where you are, uh, what the time is where you are, as well as the time back home or at some other uh, reference time zone. And then it also has a mechanical alarm. So let's just imagine if uh, your phone's dead, you can't find the charger, your charger cord broke, whatever reason, your phone's not picking up in the uh, far away, far flung country where you find yourself, you need this watch because it'll not only show you the time, but it also has a built-in alarm. And it, it's a, a pretty complicated looking dial, but it, it's very well laid out for all the things that are going on with it. And it's an interesting uh, layout because when you look at this watch, first thing, you don't see a, a crown at three o'clock and so you're not sure which way is up with it, but it is like this. And there's a lot of different things here to, to point out, but I like the case a lot. It has sort of a step bezel. And so it's a little bit uh, thick, but it is uh, it wears well for the thickness. And I think because of that step bezel, it gives you a little bit of a deception about how big it is. So it's a good size at 40 millimeter. It'll fit just about anybody's wrist perfectly well. And I love the dial color. The finishes on the dial are exquisite. Of course, it's fully loomed so that you can tell the time in the dark wherever you find yourself as well. But at the uh, 11 o'clock position, that is a power reserve indicator for the alarm. So you have to have enough power in the alarm and uh, both of these crowns unscrew. The top one is to wind for the alarm. And so as you wind it up, you'll see that power reserve indicator go up. So it's fully wound now. The alarm off on button is here on the bottom left at eight o'clock. And so that's real easy. Um, if you're wearing the watch, I'm sure it would wake you up. It gives you both a vibration and a sound. And it's uh, a tiny gong that vibrates really fast against a, um, a chime inside the movement. And we'll show you that coming up here in just a moment. At three o'clock, this is the time the alarm is set for. And you change that with this bottom uh, crown. And the top crown also is the one that you use to jump time zones. Uh, if you pull it out, you can actually see the, the hour hand move an hour at a time without messing up your minutes. And you can go forwards and backwards depending on which way you're traveling, east or west and then you pull it out once more and you can change the minutes. By changing the hour hand, like a lot of other GMT watches, that's how you access the date as well. When you turn the alarm on and off, there's an indicator right here. As I push the button, you'll see it switch from off to on, and it's got a little bell there. So that tells you whether you've got it set for the alarm to go or not. So to turn the alarm on, we simply push this button, and to turn it back off, we push it again. As we turn it over, you'll see the gong striking here in the top left as I turn it on. You see it's a really, very fast vibration. And then you can turn it off. So the only other thing on the dial we didn't talk about is that it does have the running seconds hand for the watch at six o'clock in a sub dial, but uh, the, uh, and we didn't talk about that the GMT hand is this other center hand that has a 24 hour scale around the edge of the dial so that you can read the AM and the PM in the other time zone. It does come with a beautiful Blancpain, uh, 18 karat gold double deployant buckle and the exhibition case back with all the decoration you would expect from them with all the Cotte de Genève and the chamfered bezels and, uh, bevels and, and screw heads and all of the, the rest. It's a really a bargain of a watch. When you look at the price on our website, it is amazing that you get this much complication and this much features in a watch for this many dollars. I mean, just really, uh, I encourage you to check it out on SwissWatchExpo.com. Uh, you can mouse over brands, click on Blanc Palm, and you'll be able to see this as well as all the other watches we have in stock from this great company.